married for 10 years. I got married young. I was 21, barely, like three days, 21. I already had a baby. He was eight weeks old at our wedding. I remember feeling marriage was temporary from the beginning, like that I wasn't going to make it. And I didn't know what that feeling was. I just thought it was cold feet, but it kind of manifested itself for the next 10 years. We are going through a divorce. He didn't really start this process. I guess it was it was more so because I was always looking for someone else because I didn't know how to be loved or how to accept love. And so while he was fighting for me, I was pushing him away. I left the good guy. I left the guy that everybody looks at and is like, that's a dad. That's a husband. That's how it's supposed to be. He did the dishes. He cleaned the house. He took the kids to school. He worked all day. He made good money. He supported us. Um, I mean, yeah, we had our problems, but he was the good guy. So I'm here to tell you, Bruh. it's okay to leave the good guy. <laughs> All right. Um, so let me ask the girls this. What, uh, the fuck? what do you think the future holds for this girl? We can start. Uh, who wants to go first? We can start with you. What do you think the future holds for her? I don't know. She made the right decision. She, she chose herself. Okay. So you agree with her. You think she made the right choice? Yeah. Okay. Because if she, because you're you were born by yourself and you're going to die alone. Wait, what? <laughs> like, wait, wait, okay, wait. like you came to this earth by yourself. Okay. And you're going to leave the, this earth by yourself. Have point. you ever had a dream? So what do you think? That... What, what's going to happen in her future? Then you think she made the right choice? What's what what's what's going to happen? Nothing. She'll just pursue her dreams or make it by her own or probably find a better match for her. Whatever, but you don't you don't have to depend on someone to be someone. Interesting. What? All Hold right. on. You made a good have point. Have you ever had a dream? Thank You're you. gonna die alone. Finally. But before you die, I'm sure you wanna have fun with somebody, right? Exactly. Huh? I'm sure you wanna enjoy life with somebody before you die, right? Depends if the future provides me a man that uh, uh I don't know. But she left her man. If, but I'm not like you know expecting that. All right. But like, she did, no, no. But she had the man. She left him. Just because. Yeah, I also had the men and I left him. Yeah, stupid. Well, why I'm stupid? Stupid. Why I'm stupid? I'm making my money. Because now I you're live single by myself. At Thirty and and now you're no, like you know. No, I'm single, but uh -huh. not alone. Okay, so you, <laughs> so you have dick. Yeah, of course. Well, sometimes. <laughs> what? Oh, what? I also have toys. You know. Uh, and, and cats and dogs. You what? Yeah, I have my baby. <laughs> Chanel. Oh, okay, shout out to Chewy. This is sad, man. Okay, let's. Why is sad? Because it is sad. So, no, it, it's not sad for you having to have someone for you to be happy. Isn't that sadder? Like, you know, I don't know. That's my point of view. You can be right in your life, but You're... I'm right in my life. <laughs> what? What? All right. What about you? Uh, what do you I'm think? I'm happy. You... All right. That's fine. Uh, for you, do you think that she made, uh, what do you think oh, uh, her future holds? I'm not going to lie to you. I was not paying attention to that video. And I'm so sorry. <laughs> that was so real. I was trying. I'm being so real. <laughs> She's like, she had a lot going on. I can answer. Right. I got you. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I mean, I would. I zoned out because I was. She was doing too much. I'm sorry. At least she doesn't sound stupid, you know? She's being honest. I'm being so honest. Yeah. I really zoned out when she was talking. She had no interest for me to listen, so I didn't listen. Sorry. Next. I'm so sorry. I feel like I'm with my stepdad right now. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm being on. I, you listen to what she said? I'm uncomfortable. Yeah, I did. The whole, the whole video. I heard the last one. She said someone did the dishes. I don't... <laughs> She said she had. She a, was married she, at twenty one three had, days. That's so all I heard. She hear, had she had a newborn. Her points and points. Yeah, I she had a fuck. newborn with her husband. Her husband. She had a good it. man. She yeah, thought she was it was feeling, that man, but she feels like she made the right decision by leaving him. Well, oh, she, so she, she was knew, young. She knew when, when she, she got married. Met him. She knew when she oh, got married. So he didn't do nothing wrong. Huh? She knew when she got married that this man was not going to be it for her, that it was going to end in divorce. But he didn't do nothing wrong. No. She oh, well, she dumb. The fuck? Bro, I said why you're single, man. Uh, who said I was single? You were single. <laughs> <laughs> Three nine. Uh, it's okay, though. Person, Let's say it's complicated. <laughs> All right, next. Myron, up to you, man. 
He's so done with this panel. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yo, it fucking amazes me, bro. Like, I'm so sorry. <laughs> you learn something new every day. <sighs> At least I was on it. Thank you. You're so nice. Listen, bro. That, that nigga saved you because that's the Spanish. I didn't care us. what she was saying. Y'all gonna be mad at me? Yes, because it's, it's a video for you to watch. To I'm comment sorry. On. I said I'm sorry. Damn. No, Next no, it's, 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 was... it's not damn. It's 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 a privilege to be on this platform. I'm sorry. And we told you to pay attention. Come on, like pay attention. All right. So this I is the last it. chance you get. Right. Please pay attention. I'm pay attention. You sure? Got you. Because if not, I will kick you the fuck out myself. I said I'm sorry. All right. Yo, this shit crazy, bro. Imagine we came on your show and said, you know what? This shit's boring as fuck. I'm going to zone out. I didn't say it was boring. I said, first of You said of she all, was boring to listen to. I she didn't out. have my attention. So, yes, I did zoom out. I said I'm sorry. But right. I still answered just, your just, question. Just move on. It's fine. Thank you. All right, nigga. What about Yo, you? This shit crazy. <laughs> uh, I think she's going to have a really rough road ahead of her if she thinks leaving a good situation and a marriage and a family and she's gonna go out and find something better. It's, it's not gonna work for her. She's going out sad. Yeah, right. she's gonna realize after I don't know however many dates she decides to go on that she had a good situation, and she's gonna probably go back to him. Actually, she might go back. Actually, mm -hmm. sorry. Should he take Maybe. her back? Maybe. No. But he might. He might, but he shouldn't. Mm. All right. What about All you? right. What about you? So she said she was in a relationship with him until 21, got married, had a kid with him. Um, we don't know their background on the story. Um, when I was in a relationship very young, it's she 21. just gave the background. Right. Okay. Let me finish talking, please. Y'all don't realize that with relationships like these, you guys end up in loops, and you guys end up in like a lifestyle where you guys just do the same shit every day, right? Maybe. Something happened where the guy wasn't fulfilling her needs. And it's better for a child to see their parents healthily, to leave each other and be on their own and make their decisions as to a divorce where it's toxic, fighting, hitting, abusive, toxic relationships. Because that child will grow up looking at that relationship, wanting those relationships. You know, so maybe she made that decision for her child to make that leap into being herself as a woman to be a she explained the situation and said that it wasn't toxic and he did everything he was supposed to do. Yeah. She maybe she just wasn't, maybe she just wasn't in love. That, was, that, that wasn't there. Yeah, yeah, she explained everything. She properly. literally explained everything and you said that she we don't know She just wasn't happy then. She, she just wanted to leave, right? Pretty much. Yeah. Yep. So why is that wrong? The question is, what, what does your, do you think her future holds? Her future. Yeah. She's a very young woman who has a kid and a man who is very confident in himself and has a lot going for him. He won't care. A real man, right? Mm -hmm. Not a real man. Certain men. Different men. Everyone has a different type. Everybody has their different opinions, and everybody has their different standards. A different man. Different man. Okay, got it. Let's say you raised your son, right? And uh, he became successful, became self-made millionaire, or maybe he became a doctor or a lawyer, mm -hmm. right? Making 300, 400K a, thousand, a year, right? Very successful. And he meets a woman that is 28, 29 with kids from another man. Do you think that's a good investment on his end to take that woman seriously and marry her? That's his life, and that's his decision. And no, uh, she's 30, by the way. I'm asking 30 you. She's 30 now. So yeah. she's 30 now. 30 she has ish. kids from another man. Would you want your son to take that woman seriously? Or would you advise him, hey, you know what? Maybe it's better that you go and look for something else. Yeah. What would you tell him? Because my son? Yeah, your son. Come on, Diamond. Honestly, I would say, like, <laughs> no kids. <laughs> Find a bitch who doesn't have kids. Oh, all right, cool. Thank okay. you. Yeah. Finally, you're being honest. Okay. Yeah, kids are fucking a drag, bro. It's a fucking tough world we're living. It, yeah. Kids are a drag. Could you imagine drag. taking care of kids that aren't yours? Yep. That's crazy. Fuck you, dad. You're not my dad. You're my, my dad. mom. Fuck you. Yeah. <laughs> That's why you're we stay away from this. So, <laughs> you're my mom, bitch. So you're you think she? Dad. So you think <laughs> the future holds for her that she'll find a guy that will still take her seriously? You think, right? I think when her kid is out of her life, she'll find a man. Bro, she's forty. How old will she be at that point? She's gonna be old. Fifty. <laughs> but some 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 guys don't even care. You realize that some guys don't even want children. That they want to find a woman that is already established and has a family. That they don't have to provide that. That they can just provide the lifestyle that they but can. But will they give that them? woman that serious relationship that she yearns for though? Mm -hmm. At that point, or will she just be a cougar on the roster? If they're lucky. There's very oh, few men, very rare men, that will step up to the plate to take care of another man's child. 
certain. Well, you just uh, removed the children. You said that she's 40 and the kids are <laughs> old and out the house now. So what I'm asking you now is do you think that she's still going to get a serious relationship at 40 years old? It depends how well she takes care of herself and how well she goes out and determines to get a relationship, you know? Well, let me ask you this. If she was at one point more beautiful and younger and had more options and couldn't find a guy, what makes you think she'll find that guy at 40? There's a lot of 40-year-old single men who are divorced now. Like I said, Do you think they, they want, want a 40-year-old woman in return? No, they want fucking 20-year-olds fucking pedophiles. What do you mean? Pedophile like, Gano. everyone wants a younger woman, I mean, but they can't legal. get younger uh, women. Legal, Diamond. Do you prefer young, older um, men or younger men? Me? Yeah. I, I like men my age. But obviously... You okay, like let, me, okay let me be on, Let me retract. Let me retract. I like men my age, but if I'm being honest, I would like an older man to take care of me. Oh! So you contribute to the pedophilia now. Yeah, you do, oh. actually. Girls like to say, oh, guys are into pedophilia because they prefer younger women. Like, no, 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 no. Okay, let me retract that. I didn't mean it like that. I'm just saying, like, obviously, men are gonna like younger women because, like. Younger women, they have a, you know, there's, you were you know. so fast to attack yeah, what men want. Pedophilia when you is a want strong it, it's word, okay. though. It's a very strong How word. How dare you? Okay, I would never date a young man, though. Like, someone mm -hmm. that's, that's like, point. younger that's than me, I would never. But, like, men, men, it's different. It's yeah, younger it's men. Yeah, it's different. Oh. It's, like, for me, I'm not going to date a younger guy who can't provide me shit. You know what I mean? Oh. But, like, obviously, you're going to go for a man that can, like, <laughs> y'all, Sean Kingston sing for me, yo. Oh, my God. Oh. <laughs> So you don't see how your argument has holes in it. It's no argument. And, it's just and your opinion. point didn't make sense. Yeah. yeah, well, she knows, man. I know. Incredible, bro. Yo. Yeah, she know, bro. That's Yo, why I'm man. on this podcast. You'd wish I'd see Yeah, you. yeah, well, that's why you're so single. <laughs> this is great, man. This is great. <laughs> I'm glad you guys are enjoying it. We're not, but we okay. Yeah. Uh, what about you? Um, I think that she is going to have a rough life ahead of her. She keeps on putting the good guys to the side because... There's a, it's a, there's not a lot of good guys out there. Give them a chance. Stay with them, you know? But yeah, 